Lucas Media. Shout out to the ones who support me and the ones who hate me. So we got news coming out that I actually seen two different reports. One report says per Bleacher Report, Bleacher Report, Bronny James has been medically cleared to be drafted and play in the NBA. This per uh, uh, yeah, Bleacher Report, Draft Express, Wojnarowski. Also, I seen another report come by. And I don't know how true this one is, but it's saying that Bronny has also, also plans. Oh yeah, here, you know, I'm looking at a few of them. Bronny James expected to stay in the 2024 NBA draft since he's been fully cleared to play in the NBA. Now, honestly, I know this, this ruffle feathers. Everybody don't agree with my opinion. I don't have a problem with him getting drafted. But I would, and I still think the Lakers are going to pick him in the second round. I do think that uh, LeBron and Rich Paul at Clutch is going to tell everybody to stay away. Let's make this happen. But I really hope that another team drafts LeBron. LeBron I hope LeBron understands that. And cool, you can see them on the court against each other, which will break the internet. But I just don't think that Bronny needs to be on the Lakers. It's too much of a circus over there. That would be too much dysfunction. They already got rid of the coach. When is he going to play? I mean, is he going to play for the the G League affiliate? I just don't. I don't I don't think he needs to be there. Um, now, here's the thing, right? And this is where I'm. I'm James Wiseman only played a handful of games when he was at Memphis. Now, you can argue his NBA career hasn't been what people thought it was going to be. But he only played a handful of games and was still the number two overall pick to the Golden State Warriors. Do I think Bronny is a top 10 pick at this moment? No, but he did miss significant time with a health issue with his heart. And now that he's been cleared to play, who knows? I mean, since he will more likely get drafted, he'll be able to keep. Uh, he'll be able to get better while playing in the league, and I would see him playing for a G League affiliate. And I would see, I could also see those games selling out, honestly. And maybe that's what the NBA wants, you know. And then they can recruit people. Yeah, I, I, I do see that. This is what the NBA is looking forward to. Now, here's the thing that I, that Bronny gonna have to do. He gonna have to do interviews. He gonna have to answer some tough questions. And LeBron has carefully. Made it to where him and Bryce don't do interviews. Now, when he was in high school, I had no problem with that. I mean, he was a kid. But Bronny is trying to go he, trying to go to a, a man's league. So, you got to be able to answer questions like men. You got to be able to answer the tough questions. You know, y- y'all can't be coddling him to where he don't do no interviews. He gave one statement at USC. That's it. And it was a statement about his health condition. And then you never heard from him again. Which... Is unheard of because you always see other players go up to the podium and give interviews. So I just, you know, we can't. I, no, man, that can't happen in the league. He gonna have to talk. He gonna have to do one on one interviews and even interview, get interviewed by more mom and pop interviewers. You know what I mean? Especially if he go to the G League. But shout out to him, man. Salute to him that he's medically cleared. Again, health is wealth, and I hope that he does make it to the league. Do I think he should come out this year? No, but I mean, if he does and the team picks him, I'm going to support him. But if the Lakers pick him and they hire J.J. Reg as the coach, I mean, come on now. Y'all going to, I'm really going to go in on, on, on LeBron because that, that's ridiculous. But I want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.